Hey guys, so here we are. Uh, I usually don't do it this way, record this way, but um, I'm gonna give you guys a little preview of something that I purchased. Obviously, uh, you can see that <clears throat> my hands aren't on the controls, so what could I possibly be using to control this train? And obviously, it is the rail driver controller. Um, I'm not exactly in a good position to show you guys what's going on here. Um, but I'll, I'll do my best. So, I'm not going to record the full run. I just want to do a little bit of a preview how this works. Um, so, obviously, let's see. I can't even see this angle is good. But, uh, yeah, so we're running here with the ACS-64, and, um, coming up on Frankfurt Junction and a speed restriction. We're going to be switching over to the local track, so... Uh, throw her in the dynamic brake range, which works pretty nicely. Uh, the switches work. Um, let's see. You can't, you can't hear anything, can you? There we go. The only complaint I really have about this right now is that the throttle isn't notched, uh, so and it's not as sensitive as I thought it would be, so uh, it's a little difficult to gauge exactly where you are on the throttle, but um, <clears throat> otherwise it works pretty well. See, I'm jumping straight. I, you can't see it from here, maybe, but I'm jumping straight from 0% to 11% before. I have all this range of motion before it actually picks up the fact that I'm moving the controller. Um, it's not a huge deal, but it's, it's interesting to say nonetheless. I haven't tried the independent brake yet. I don't know if that works. Oh yeah, it works. Independent brake works. Um, headlight switch works. Uh, these are the lights. Turn them off. Turn them on. Sander. Bell. That's the alerter. I obviously have it deactivated, otherwise it wouldn't be working on this route. Um, so all the camera views are on the bottom. They're not as... Uh, the buttons aren't as sensitive as I think they would be or should be, but... As of right now, I think we're still, it's still, maybe it needs to be broken in or something, but, uh, so you can change the speed display from kilometers, uh, miles to kilometers. So obviously it, it toggles, I don't know what's up with that. I don't know if it's supposed to do that or not, but, uh, it's whatever. I'm not even going to be using that very often anyway.
I'll do a test um, with the New Jersey Transit equipment after this. Uh, I've always wondered how a rail driver, the brake handle would interplay with the transit stock, considering uh, you know, this is a this is a continuous lap brake, whereas handle, uh, whereas a uh, New Jersey Transit's manual lap. So I'd, I'd have to see how that uh, that interplays with the rolling stock. I'm thinking about actually creating an, uh, another sticker and labeling it on this side for the New Jersey Transit stock if I can get this uh, to work properly with that. But we'll see. All right, um, <clears throat> I'm gonna depart with this and then we'll check out the New Jersey Transit stock. How that works with that? <coughs> mm. So I can figure out these camera view things. External one. Okay, there we go. And then. the free free camera there we go that moves it I think I still need to use the mouse for the uh, the panning but I suppose I suppose that's fine okay so Thank you. 
Alright, I'm gonna load up some transit equipment, see how that works. See you in a bit. Alright, we're back. I'm gonna load up some transit equipment. ALP 46, uh, 530 departure, well, 526 departure from Trenton. Uh, see how this thing works with the brake on this thing. Uh. Alright, so. <clears throat> Turn the cab light off. Um, hmm. Okay, so gauge lights on. if the lights are on outside actually. Uh, oh they are, All right. Ooh, head, uh, wipers don't, oh the wipers do work. What the heck? All right, that's weird. So the wiper controls are inverted on the 46, I think. Yeah, that's weird. Um, that's not important, I'm, I don't use the wipers anyway. So, okay, so rever uh, reverser. Huh. Something's changing, but it's not registering on the, on the, on the heads up display. Throttle works, and it brake works. All right, now for the actual brake handle. I, I mean, reverse is not a big issue. I can always set it. Yeah, I can always set it. It's not an issue. Um, okay, so brake handle. It's gonna be interesting. Let's see how this works. Oh, it does work. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So the brake handle works. I just might need to actually relabel this. Uh, so let's see, we have electric hold, and then we have lap. And we have service lap service lap and handle off and emergency detent. Okay, so it should work fine. Let's try it out. Take it out for a spin up to Hamilton. Yeah. All right. So. If I can get this to play right. Okay, the bell doesn't work. Horn works. That's odd, the bell doesn't work. Okay, the bell works. Alright, whatever. I'm not gonna bother that. Turn on ditch lights.
Okay, yeah. so the only thing that doesn't work on this one is the bell button, for some reason, it doesn't work. But, uh, and again, the headlight switches are, the well not the headlights, the uh, wiper switches are sort of inverted. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why. It's, it's weird. But, uh... Okay, see, now they work. I think, yeah, I think this thing just still needs to be broken in. It's not fully broken in yet. I just opened it, like, not two hours ago. So, um, <clears throat> it's still, I guess it's still a little sticky, some of the, some of the, uh, some of the controls. So, I mean, other than that, you can see it works. Uh, I'm going to be playing around with this a lot. For the next uh, couple weeks, probably Just seeing what works, what doesn't. Uh, gonna finally finish breaking it in. Um, yeah. Other than that, I think that's that's pretty much it. There's nothing more to see. Uh, I'm gonna <clears throat> gonna just do it the easy way. Uh, F. What what is this? Uh, two. Oh, that's not it. Cancel two. That's it. All right. So we're gonna do. Free camera, free camera, and then nope. Free camera. Come on. Okay, that doesn't actually work. All right, so I'm gonna have to use the keyboard for this. And yeah, that's. All for now. Uh, so, until next time, see ya.